One, two, three. One, two, three. Do you feel you have made a huge statement in your debut game as people will see this result as a huge upset in the ISL? Well, I just think that we, we did a competitive game. We knew what we were expecting from a brilliant side like Mumbai City. And we followed the plan. The players did a fantastic job. I'm so pleased with all of them. Even the guys that didn't have so much time in, in to the game or even the ones that didn't have a single minute, but they were pushing the team from the bench. And I know even the ones that we, we still are in the hotel. And I'm so pleased with what they've seen. This is just the start of, I believe, a, a serious season for Northeast United. And obviously I'm happy, but we need to keep improving a lot of things at the same time. Was Ahmed Jahu's red card the turning point? And what is your assessment of the youngsters in your team? Two-part question. Yeah, obviously a, a penalty sent off always uh, are moments of the games of any single football game that can make the things go in one favor or another, but at the end, there are more moments. If you just uh, relax, obviously a team like this will punish you. So we kept that mentality. We were a sweet John all the time, and we, we were really strong in that way. So I'm, I'm really happy about it. Um, the second part, sorry, did you say? The second part is, what is your assessment of the youngsters in your team? So the youngsters, I, I said already to a few people is, you know, when you have these kind of players that they have this desire to improve every day, to become better every day, the things are easy. Obviously, we lacking sometimes this composure maybe, but I'm so pleased to have them because they want to become better. They are better today than what they were yesterday and tomorrow they have to be even better than what they are today. And we are lucky that we have this, com uh, it's not just young players, we have this combination, this mix between experience and obviously those, those, those young players like you just mentioned. Why did Gallego not start today? Because I think the rules only can play 11 players and we have more than 11 players. So we, at the end, as a coach, you have to decide for, for the 11 starter that you think can provide the best in that moment. But for me, it's not just important if one player starts or not. For me, uh, what really matters is that everybody, when comes in, they're going to give 100%. And obviously, Gallego, when he did, when he came, he did that. We could show big, big work from his, his work. And I'm so pleased with him. Without him, this three points wouldn't be right now in our pocket. So thanks to him as well. How impressed were you with the defensive shape and solidity of your team? Do you think Northeast is favorite against KBFC in the upcoming game? I will start with the second question. No way at all we are favorites. Um, the coming game, Kerala Blaster is going to be even more tougher than this one. Uh, I think if, if you know the objective, a lot of data that they have about them, we are in terms of many ways in, in a different position. So they, they got much bigger salary and so on. So uh, we, we, we know our identity. We're going to try to do as best as we can, but no way we are favorites at all. I know I saw the game last night, but definitely they have huge good principles of play. They're going to become stronger, stronger, and they're going to be for sure in, on the top of the ladder. I'm, I'm just concerned how we can, can deal with the coming game, but I know they're going to be so tough and they're going to be on the top. How important was this performance to you and where do you rate it? It was not just for me, it was for the team. I think always when you start a new season, a new project, it's good to start with uh, three points, if possible. But uh, it's, it's not just that. I think overall, the feeling, even if we, the results were not in our favor, you could see that there is a clear pattern of, of way. And I said that since day one, we're going to be a team that will fight, that will never give up. And that's definitely what we've seen today and also in the two friendly matches that we had before this uh, championship has started. Thank you, Jared. A pleasure. Thank you, guys. Thank you, coach. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you.